Billy Nashville bomber. He blew himself up on Christmas Day. He gave all the town folk warning to get out of harm's way. Sometimes people just blow up. He committed suicide in his RV. He had some sort of beef against AT&T. He left his house to a woman who lived out in LA. She claimed to barely know him. He believed all sorts of conspiracies. He was a crazy loner introvert. I guess he had enough. Gonna go out with a bang and blow up lots of stuff. His death inconvenienced a lot of folks. That is certainly true. He didn't kill anyone else. Don't it make him almost a hero? Unlike all the other mass shooter suicides we see on the news almost every day, I think it's much better to just blow up private property. Another angry man filled with rage. It's the sign of the times today. Another angry man, not okay. It's the sign of the times. time of rage. Remember the Nashville shooter? He was assigned a girl. Didn't feel right in that gender. Got no help from that Christian school. He was a quiet overachiever. Everyone thought was sweet and nice. He was an artist, living as a daughter with no acceptance in sight. The daughter became a man, drew up a violent plan. He amassed a lot of guns, determined to get it done. He was diagnosed on the spectrum. Don't he have a right? To be the person he was born to be, isn't that why some people fight? Another angry man filled with rage, it's the sign of the times today. Another angry man, not okay, it's the sign of the times. Gun-loving right-wing assholes are shooting up cans of beer. They want to set everyone straight as they declare war on the queer. They'd rather ban drag queens and air 15s, blame every problem on the poor. They say suffering is what they deserve. Riches are for the pure. This world we live in is shades of gray. I don't think killing is ever right. But I try to keep in mind, ain't nothing just black and white. Remember Oklahoma City? Do you remember Timothy McVeigh? He was that white supremacist who declared war on the USA. He bombed the federal building, then he quickly ran away. He had so many supporters who thought what he did was okay. The government hunted him down. He was executed by the state. The last meal he requested was in and out Burger on his plate. His supporters are still out there today, no longer hidden in the shadows. The fascist voice on the rise, democracy's downfall in their eyes. Another angry man filled with rage, it's the sign of the times today. Another angry man, not okay, it's the sign of the times.